Grinding. What is grinding process? The grinding process is a method of material removal, using a grinding wheel or a grinder as a cutting tool. Different types of grinding processes are used in industries for the material removal purposes. There are different types of grinding machines available. These grinding machines are classified based on their construction or type of surface produced. Such as, bench grinding machine, surface grinding machine, cylindrical grinding machine, centerless grinding machine, internal grinding machine, and special purpose grinding machine. In this video, we will see the construction details of the bench grinder and the surface grinder, which are most commonly used. Construction details of the bench grinder. This grinder we call a bench grinder because it is used by placing on a bench. The size of this grinder is small and it is used for small purposes, such as the sharpening of small tools like a single point cutting tool. Parts of bench grinders are Base, which supports all other components of the machine. A motor. It is the most essential part of the grinding machine. It is mounted on the base, and it provides the rotation to the grinding wheel and the working capability of the grinder is determined by the horsepower of the motor. Horsepower of the motor affects the number of revolutions per minute of the grinding wheel. The higher the RPM, the faster you can finish the job, this is important when you are working with hard materials such as steel. The shaft of the motor is extending out on both sides. On both ends, the grinding wheels are mounted. The grinding wheels are the ones who will do the actual work of removal of material. These wheels come in different types, the maximum RPM at which these wheels can be operated is printed on the cover, and this RPM should never be exceeded. Overspeeding can explode the wheel and cause serious injuries or death. These grinding wheels are made up of abrasive materials, such as aluminium oxide, silicon carbide, cubic boron nitride, and diamond dust based on the requirement. And also they have different grits to serve different purposes. One of the wheels mounted on the shaft will have coarse abrasive grains, and the other wheel will have fine abrasive grains. On top of the wheels, there are wheel guards provided. These guards act as spark deflectors, and also prevent fragments of an exploding wheel from flying towards the operator. These guards should cover above 75% of the wheels to prevent any object or human hand from accidentally coming in contact eye shield this is also another protective feature that is provided to protect the eyes of the operator and it is transparent tool rest tool rest is also provided in front of the wheels to hold the workpiece while grinding it should be tight and should be very close to the wheel to prevent the workpiece from slipping down surface grinding machine this grinding machine is used for finishing to provide a good surface finish for the workpiece this machine uses a grinding wheel to remove the material from the surface of the workpiece and provide a good surface finish. Construction details. This grinding machine has a base over which the entire assembly is placed, and it also absorbs the vibrations generated during the operation. There is a saddle that is connected to the base, over which the work table is placed. There are two handwheels provided, one is a hand traversing wheel, other is a cross slide handwheel. Hand traversing wheel gives motion to the table in the longitudinal direction. Whereas, the cross slide handwheel provides the crosswise motion to the work table. Work table. The work table helps in holding the job which is to be ground. Above the work table, there is a magnetic table, which magnetizes and holds the workpiece in a fixed position. These are the splash guards, which prevent the sparks from going out and hitting something besides the machine. This is the column, inside which the driving mechanism is placed. The grinding wheel head is connected to the column, on which a grinding wheel made up of abrasives is mounted. This grinding wheel does the actual work of material removal. There is a wheel guard that covers the grinding wheel so that there is no accidental touch happens during the operation. This is a vertical feed handwheel, which gives the motion to the grinding wheel head in the vertical direction, with this wheel we can make the head move up and down. It is employed to give depth of cut. There is a coolant pipe provided, that helps in reducing the temperature of the workpiece during the grinding process. The most commonly used liquid, as a coolant is water. 
Let's see the working of the surface grinding machine. The workpiece to be ground is placed on the magnetic table, and the lever is turned on to magnetize and hold the workpiece rigidly. Now, coolant is turned on, and by using both hand transverse wheel and cross slide wheel, the grinding of the workpiece surface is carried out. I hope you have understood the construction details of bench and the surface grinding machines. If you want to learn more from my channel, click on the subscribe button, and turn on the notifications to get all my latest videos. Also, you can help ADTW learn to reach out to more engineers like you, by sharing this video with your friends who want to understand this topic.